Welcome to the wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day, Episode 1. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And tonight, we are going to have a simple kind of beginner shave. Something relaxing. I am going to start with my Gold Dollar 208 that we honed up. All right, which any beginner could get off the internet. All right, shave ready from uh, somebody that hones and uh, can is reputable. All right, and then I am going to use this. This is my Vanderhagen, okay, shave set, and this is the premium shave set. So it comes with a brush, a soap, and a bowl all in this one box and it is cheap enough off of uh, Amazon that uh, anybody could do this all right and it works it really does this is how I started and now I've had the soap blooming like normal so we're gonna pour off some of that bloom water all right we're gonna put that on as a pre-shave Alright, and how I would describe this, hmm, just, it, it's kind of a clean scent, okay? There's not a whole lot going on in the way of, like, cologne or something like that. Yeah, it's just clean, alright? Which is good, because that means this could go with anything. All right, anything at all, any kind of cologne, any kind of aftershave, and it would be fine. All right, now that brush is a hundred percent whore hair, and it is definitely good enough to start with. All right, and it's not a big, big old honking huge brush but it's good enough, okay? And now I got that soap in there, and let's load up this brush, all right? So tell me guys, how are you doing? Hopefully you're well, and uh, life is treating you good, yeah? And you're healthy. That is so important. You have to be healthy, guys. You need to take care of yourself, do what you need to do. You know, we're in 2017 now, and we're hoping for a really good year. A healthy year for you, happy year for you. Yep. All right, now this soap is just going gangbusters, okay? Here you go. All right, now, uh, for your convenience, in the description, I will have all the ingredients for that soap and the scent profile if I can find it. Uh, actually, it, to me, it just smells clean, all right? Plus, I will have uh, links to all of the products I'm using, including that 30-degree strop back there, all right? Now, let's get going. Yeah, this Vanderhagen set is actually relatively inexpensive. You can pick up the whole thing on Amazon and you can get a brush, you can get a bowl, you can get, uh, you know, the whole set for uh, cheaper than you could buy uh, a brush a lot of times. All right. So now this looks like it needs a little more water. Let's just go ahead and my brush, this one I haven't used in a while, so my brush seems to be shedding a little bit. Maybe, you know, I, I did have it soaking, but now again, this was the one I started with. So, in the beginning, I didn't understand so much about how you do everything. And when you're soaking your brush, you know, don't soak 
it all the way up here into the knot and the glue in this area. Just get like, I put it in water like this about halfway in, into hot water, okay? And in the beginning, I wasn't doing that. I was putting the whole thing in, and I'm afraid I may have break, broken down that glue to an extent that uh, it's losing hairs. You know, you see it, it, it is a, a decent brush though, as far as all of that goes. So, you know, it's got a nice splay, holds more than enough so, okay, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, let's give that a try. That looks pretty good right there. And this has got like shea butter and things like that in it. So it's really good for the skin. So if you have sensitive skin, this might be the ticket. All right, so this is episode one. So that's with the grain. And for me, this is with the grain in this area. Okay, now here, That's with the gray. And down here, this is going to be across the grain. Uh, well, yeah, it's going to be across the grain on my jawline. and mostly on my neck. Now, right down the middle there, that is with the grain. And now, this is going to be with the grain on this side. Then I'll just kind of finish up and clean that off a little bit. across the grain. Okay, there's that Vanderhagen soap, guys. It's got enough cushion and does well enough job, uh, for me at least, with a straight razor.
All right, there we go. All right, now same thing on this side. Basically, my beard grows the same way. Uh, my neck is a little different, my jawline's a little different, but uh, we're gonna handle it all the same because of the way I do my two and a half pass shave. And again, look at this, it's great. Okay, awesome, awesome, great cushion, definitely doable with a straight razor. All right, there you have it, pass one complete. And now guys, seriously, this could be a beginner set for anybody and it'll work fine. Oh yeah, nice. Okay, we did good. All right, coming up next is episode two, which is going to be a pass and a half, and we're gonna finish off this shave. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. Click right over here to see episode two and see how the shave ends. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.